Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to another Grounded video. So in this video, we're going to cover one of the hardest insects in the game right now, and that's going to be the Black Widow. We'll go ahead and take a look at our data card and uh, just refresh your memory on these guys. No weaknesses and resistant to everything. Now, there's been a bit of a... Uh, a bit, a bit of talk about what's not being shown in the patch notes and between resistances and weaknesses and stuff like that. So as a, as far as I'm understanding it, uh, the Black Widow is basically resistant to everything, even generic weapons or uh, mighty weapons such as the uh, Club of the Mother Demon here. But getting into that, the best way to do this, the best way to attack these Black Widows, uh, we'll get into it a few different ways. Um, they are very similar to wolf spiders. They're going to attack the same. They have the th same three hit attack. Uh, I believe it's the orb weavers, uh, but it's just a lot quicker and they have a ton of health, a lot more health than the uh, broodmother actually. So they're tough and they're fast and they have venom and poison as well. And I believe they're no longer weak to poison. So that doesn't do anything either. So you can see our setup right here. Um, hold on. We have a friend here. All right. So now we're going to heal up after that little battle there. Um, you can see our setup here. We have the fire ant helmet, the fire ant uh, gear, whole thing. It's going to increase acid damage, which we're not doing any acid damage. We don't have any weapons that are doing that. But it is giving us plus corrosion. Um, these are all level 9 sleek, uh, just for that added bonus. You can see down here, acidic splash. Uh, chance to hit with an additional splash of, splash of acid when attacking in melee. Increase damage dealt by acid-based effects. And then our immediate, uh, medium armor. And then we have the corrosion attack. Attacks have a chance to weaken enemy defense. So because I know that the Black Widow has a ton of extra health, uh, I'm trying to lower the defense while I'm getting these big hits in. So uh, depending on how I feel, um, I may use the Makuhidal and uh, the Fire Ant Shield to give us that extra block strength and block corrosion. We're going to show you guys that right here. So this is going to give us the uh, blocking attacks a chance to briefly lower the attacker's defense. And we can actually block more. And then we have the Life Steal. So I'm probably going to go ahead and use the Makuhidal just because it does provide that Life Steal. Now I know it's been uh, nerfed as well. And uh, it's not really been said. And it sounds like we have a little friend over here already. We got a couple of them here. So and you can see right here now, because of the natural explorer uh, change, we're in combat here and I can't run. Can't run no matter what. I haven't even engaged with them, but I can't run. And this is whether you have natural explorer on or off. It doesn't really matter. So I'm going to go ahead and pause this real quick. And go back into it so the way you want to do this i'm using the makahuitl the uh, fire ant shield with the fire ant armor set i'm going to kill these widowlings the best way to do this is to try to fight the black widow on its own solo uh 1v1 so you don't want to deal with these black widowlings adding that additional poison because these guys stack up there's anywhere from five to eight of them uh in each of the black widow caves so i'm gonna go ahead and take these guys out and then we'll break uh break back into uh, the gear and what mutations and everything i'm using You can see they are similar to the Orb Weaver Juniors in that they are poisoning us. Use that Makuhito. We still get that life steal, even though it's not as uh, not as big. So point number one is just clear out the Black Widowlings, uh, however many there are, before you go to uh, take on the Black Widow. I'll show you the location we're at. We're at the one right over here under the uh, toolbox. I know there's one over here. There is one in the undershed that acts more of like a boss um, to get to the, uh, the lab down there. But first things first is just get rid of these... Uh, the black widowlings. I'm gonna go ahead and pop a smoothie there. Eat some food real quick. No water filtration tablets needed. Make sure our stuff is uh, maxed out as well as it can be. And for mutation wise, I'm basically just running the same things because I know that um, some of the other stuff doesn't really do much. So you don't really want to use uh, uh, mom jeans because your widowlings will get uh, murdered. Um, so I stick literally just with Perry Master. We have some more Black Widow links here, so they're venturing out of the cave, which is actually nice. That way I don't have to uh, bait them out. But I'm trying to uh, show you guys something here. So I'm just using Parry Master for the uh, perfect blocks, because you're definitely going to want to do that. Practice over and over with Wolf Spiders, and then once you get to the Black Widow, you'll be able to perfect block a lot easier, so you're not getting hit by that Venom and that Poison. Um, buff Lungs for Max Stamina, Meat Shield for the Max Health. Um, we're going to go ahead and take off a Natural Explorer. We're going to put on, uh, not that one. We're gonna go ahead and put on spicy safety for the stabbing uh, resist because I feel like uh, when they are biting you, when they're attacking you, it's stabbing damage. And then we have, of course, uh, coup de grass. Actually, I'm gonna switch spicy safety for, uh, what is it? 
yeah, trapper peeper, so we get the more the stronger critical hits. That's the the idea is to get as much damage as we can while weakening the defenses. So that's our uh, setup here. We're gonna go ahead and throw our smoothies in here. We just have uh, fuzz on the rocks for the max health, a uh, beefy one. Then we're gonna have sticky liquid rage and sticky human food. So you can see the liquid rage is gonna increase our attack, and because it's sticky, it's gonna last longer. And then same thing with the sticky human food, damage resist, and it's gonna last longer. So we're gonna throw those in our. Uh, Hot bar there, and then we're going to go ahead and head into the cave in here and see if we can't go get this girl. So this is the one I showed earlier. We'll see if there's any more whittlings in here and see if we can't get them out. Alright, well, I don't see any. So I'm not doing good on the blocks because I was trying to find the Whittlings and I didn't know the Black Widow would come out here this quick. We're going to go ahead and get our heals up and we'll get back in the fight here. And you can see sometimes she's going to back up to basically try to get you to follow her. Keep getting these blocks off and they just stick up on the attacks. You can see that three prong attack right there. Just get hits in when you can. And make sure you're getting your blocks off as well. Don't go to her. Let her come to you. Because she will try to bait you into her attacks. Go ahead, pop another smoothie, get our health back up there. You might miss a few attacks because of uh, how she's aligned. But you can see the attack pattern pretty easily. Getting my butt kicked a little bit here, but we're going to heal up. You see, it's kind of a pain to fight her in these caves. Because some of the stuff does get in the way when you're sitting there trying to attack her, so you might miss some attacks. Just kind of once you get used to her, uh, the timing of her attacks, it becomes a lot easier. And there we go. So I took one too many. I took a lot of hits right there on that one. It is a little difficult because if you when you get into the groove of fighting them, so if you fought one before and you go fight another one, they're a lot easier to fight. Um, but just kind of getting that attack pattern down, similar to the wolf spiders, but they're a lot quicker. You'll see some of the attacks get missed. And then depending on the terrain, because they like to move a lot in this little area. So because it's not a flat terrain, you might miss some hits. They might miss some hits. But the biggest thing just like that is to uh, clear out the uh, the Black Widowlings and then go ahead and fight the uh, the Black Widow one-on-one. -on -one. And you'll see they drop Black Widow Venom or Black Widow Fangs. They also drop uh, the Spider Venom as well, the Super Spider Venom. Obviously, we didn't get any that time, so that's kind of a rare drop. But other than that, I mean, that's uh, that's pretty much it. I recommend having the liquid rage smoothies. I recommend having the uh, human food smoothies. Then obviously your beefy, um, beefy fuzz on the rocks for that max heal and uh, it, the increased health as well. So that's all I got. Using the Makahuitl and the uh, the shield to lower their defense while you're doing the attacks. It helps out a lot. So that's all we got for this video, guys. Hopefully you guys can get out there and go slay some Black Widows and uh, get that gold card, get all your Super Venom, get yourself some of that Widow gear. So, all right, guys, we'll see you in the next one. Thanks. Later. Hey, thanks again for watching, everybody. If you like that video, go ahead and check out one of these videos right here. Thanks. Bye.